I think Georgia Tech has been a part of this community for quite some time, and they've been producing uh, many brilliant, brilliant minds that go off and do wonderful things later on. It just so happens that a couple of those people with those brilliant minds who go off to do wonderful things have kind of made their way to me. Sip and I started, like I said, like maybe like eight years ago, and so he's been like a big brother to me. Um, when I was really struggling to find investors and find partners because I knew what I was doing in terms of innovation. We were able to get some really cool patents, so the technology was there, but I was, I was really looking for the support and guidance and, and kind of direction, and I didn't know how to go about getting it. Uh, with the proper help and, you know, resources, relationships, dots being connected along the way, he needs to surround himself uh, with people who can do all the things that he can't do while he's focusing on being brilliant. To me, the importance of an event like this comes from two things. One is, it, it really, because it is a big, splashy event, brings people to campus that otherwise wouldn't necessarily have been on campus. And for me, as the school chair in electrical and computer engineering, it, it really is an opportunity for us to show off what we have what our beautiful campus looks like, what our maker spaces look like. So these APS kids that were here today, they toured our facilities before the fireside chat. And just, just welcoming people to campus is meaningful to me. To make sure that this was not just a singular act, hey, here's Tip Harris on stage, but that we started the conversation around something. But he called me on it and actually asked, what do you need? I said to me, success is if I can get 25 high school kids out in the audience today to show up in my classroom in two years. And he just then and there said, okay, 25 scholarships coming right up. It was amazing. I mean, that generosity and that kind of willingness to invest in the community really blew me away.